yeah. not even giving him the opportunity to make a lot of this range. Like, he's at 156, but he's not doing anything. What? Oh, okay. wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. Oh, no. yeah. yeah. Yeah, you got to die for that. You deserve it. Almost every F smash in this game, if it if it gets blocked, you're getting one of your right. stuff. Except for Mennonite. Oh that my guy's god, got wait. Oh! Trunk Mouse! Trunk Mouse! And he might not even get a chance to toss. They might want to wait that out. Lowering the shoulder there, too. Trying to get a second time. Up smash not connecting. Charge rising tackle. Neither Armadillo. Many, many more chances here, too. Mm-hmm. Okay, percent oh starting goodness. to climb. Watch how you Huge. get up off that ledge. That is big right here, but not big enough. Look at the Aura oh, Spear. Oh my goodness, run it Lord. back. Gets the Nair, nothing quite off of it yet, and I like that down there. Down there, of course, a pretty quick option up close. You know, if space proper, or if time properly, excuse me, he can get back to the ground and shield before you even get a chance to follow back up. And forward tilt on shield there, too. Nurse has to find a landing. Armadillo putting on a ton of percent here, too. Just like nickel and diming at this point. We're not finding too much on big hits as of late. Just these forward airs keeping this juggle alive for Armadillo. But the big hit will come eventually. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. Yeah, Ooh. there it is, back air. Beautiful, beautiful combo by Armadillo. And yeah, to be honest, I don't really understand either. Like, maybe the, uh, maybe Curleon's trying to get in Armadillo's head. I imagine that that's the possibility, you know, like just try to like get them like, okay, I'm the heaviest character in the game. I'm going to live way longer. Your character thrives off of like cheesing at early percents because you're Lucario, but you're not going to be able to do that against me. Oh. Except for when you're getting good down smash it. Now I would expect to see a little bit more off stage pressure here in this match. We didn't quite see it with Terry. Ooh. Not to say Terry can't bring it either, but you know, the Falcon boots hit a little different. All right. Yeah, and you talked about like how Terry might be able to catch disengages with like a uh, crack shot, but able to run it down. We talked about Siphon in the previous set, but Mithra against Lucario can absolutely press this character out for yeah. days, for days. And on top of that, I always say Lucario is not a real character until 40%. A lot of a lot of this character stuff just doesn't work until a bit of aura and rage. I will say though, Ali Modelo's landing on DM shield super safely, just applying all this pressure. He's gonna be able to get the neutralize into the grab, catching the mistech into the down smash, Ooh. already all of this damage, and is that actually going to be the stock yes it is yeah it's a very hard position to recover from because if you have a move that has to recover kind of straight up lucario's down air is really easy to time and lasts a very long time yeah dm you know what just able to mash pop out do that alumadella had the light idea on being able to catch the landing okay really nice grab out of shield oh i like the idea i like the idea trying to call out a jump or something along those lines with the neutral beat oh but wait wow. wait that was so sick absolutely okay now no double jump has to get back on but not going to be able to read armadillo's drift correctly that is one of the most ambiguous recoveries in the game Whoa. and smash at center and now they gotta get some extra credit here yeah forward tell always a great reliable kill option when you have mm. that aura oh Ooh. what a snipe hold on playing very aggressive here I can guarantee he's going to go for that uh, counter. Just <laughs> yeah. did not come out in time. Oh, with the miss tech into the down smash. Oh. Okay, yeah. yeah. <laughs> JTI was definitely trying to uh, see that aura spear, but now they're in trouble, man. We were talking about this a little bit a while ago with aura and like Kirby's one hit away from dying. Mm -hmm. And so is Armadillo, but I'd be more concerned for Kirby. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Which is typically safe. It's usually minus two. Okay, Armadillo finally going to be able to fire back. 86% though already. And like you said, the platforms have just been letting Quick get all this movement going. And now Armadillo has to chase down. Finds the back air though. And that's going to be the stop. I'm a draw legend. Yeah. And uh, one thing I want to note here is just that limit. you got to keep your eyes on that limit. Because his kills are mostly going to be coming from... Ooh, that limit. I mean, he's trying to just... Throwing out these up smashes, wants to end the stock early. That's even something we see with that Diddy Kong, right? Oh! He's so good at those tricky Lucario things that you could only see Armadillo pull off, right? Wait, that's the first time we mentioned that Armadillo is the best Lucario in the world. And you guys yeah. are getting a treat getting to see him right for now. Sure. You know, we take it for granted uh, since we've, you know, commentated. Also, off is on the side stream. Pacho just took a game five last hit set against Dave. Make sure to check out the side Incredible. stream you guys have it. Huge back air there. Getting back into the game. Up air two catching the landing. Huge back air. Banana in the f on the floor. Lucario Banana, I don't, oh. that's super scary. Do it. Build Aura. Oh. That almost did it though. Yeah, I was a little bit I skeptical it. that it wouldn't kill, but I mean, sometimes this is how you write Lucario's comebacks. Almost dying, I mean, you oh, never yeah, know. Man. I've seen, I've seen such big deficits for Armadillo and he has the resilience to build it back. That's what his character no entails. No and look at Armadillo only sitting at 96%. Oh, I like how Richie went for the hard green on the up smash there. I feel like you have to 
like stop the bleeding somehow. But Armadillo, once again, playing so passive, just, you know, trying to get back to stage and then going to reset every single time. I love yeah. when players choose to reset instead of just mashing their way. Right. I mean, Armadillo is doing an amazing job of keeping himself unpredictable, staying elusive, using the hurt box, pull back with the forward smash to punish any landing from Richie Litt. Uh, is very, very well read. And right now, uh, with Rage and Aura, this is looking a little bit tougher, particularly on ledge. Okay, going for the smash attack, not gonna be able to hit it. Unfortunately, Richie just being a little bit unsure. They're going for the up smash, but I think the uh, F yeah. smash would have actually connected here. Mm -hmm. Going for the charge, but the side B not gonna be able to do it. And now Armadillo has all the rage and the aura in the world, and you are going for a rock. Great idea, it's like, I'm gonna break your crafting box so you can't build, and then it spawns right in front of him like that. Ooh, Armadillo, what a really good start. Not gonna kill just yet with that anvil. I could be wrong, but I do think the last time these two players have faced that Sword did come out with the win, but again, it's kind of like a back and forth thingy. So it's hard to say. Oh, just hits that straight up F smash to work out, and it's gonna get the job done. I had the there. right idea by going high with that double jump, but I'll prop with the anvil. Yeah. I think maybe he expected like an air dodge onto stage there to cover that, but didn't give it to him. And he's adapted well to these minecarts at least. He's able to jump out of the minecart before the counter comes out, so he's not in a position where he'll get destroyed by it. Okay. It's gonna be okay. The anvil just eating up that aura, but he gets Ooh. that back air. Armadillo still just trying to get this aura up. Think Quick realizes what's going on here, so we're gonna see a lot, a little bit more Zare coming out. The up B is going to be punished by the Nair, but can't Ooh. find the finisher on it. Both of them are really scrapping here, but great charge shot to stop the momentum on the extreme Beautiful. speed. That's Jeez. a once a game mix up. You gotta be ready for it. And Quick was not ready for it that time. Armadillo almost finding a massive tech chase. I thought he would have liked to maybe go through like an up side B. Still able to cover the goal Ooh. and the huge will be oh, yeah. brewing something malicious. Absolutely beautiful parry. A little quick little punish into the neutral as well. Uh -oh. Quick now in a bit of a nasty spot. Well air dodging, <laughs> but uh, still safe. Yeah, that air dodge was a little weird going down. No way. I thought that was going to be the tilt that won that, but it is going to be the extreme speed off the bomb right on the ledge. Here comes Quick, though, getting that charge that he needs, but Armadillo also getting an Aura Sphere charged up as well. There's Look the up the air. Pressure. I don't know if you can live one, one more of those, Dara, especially from above the platform height. And you're not going to be able to get away with shielding. Absolutely not. When you got a constant, like, charging neutral B, that is so much pressure that you do not want on you at all. Quick wave landing, directional air dodging all over the place, just looking to get any space away from Armadillo falling in with the up air. But Sam is a little bit too heavy. So, so close. Okay, good aerial by Quick. Quick going to be able to get set up here. But it is just going to be the...